Con Confucianism has definite similarities to Islam. This should also have some similarity. And shall we attempt to study the Holy Quran in the light of this uh, Confucius symbolism and try to discover the same order or similar order? Why it is important according to him, and that point is very valid and important point too, because he believes, as we also know, that in many things, although Confucianism is similar, but it has been corrupted by man as well. And in many places the order has been changed, and the teaching has also been interpolated. So maybe this order also is defective. If we understand it generally, and then understand the similar phenomenon in the Holy Quran, then with the help of the Holy Quran we'll be able to correct this order and use the Holy Quran as a touchstone for truth and rectifying this. So it will be a very great and a very interesting new avenue which will be opening to the Chinese people and if they see it in this way they will understand this much better than any other slow approach from Islam. You know, then they will be deeply convinced because in this they already believe. They have already seen useful applications of this order and symbolism. So when they see Islam, the Holy Quran already, not only speaking of this order but of greater orders and uh, also to be in a position to rectify the wrongs committed by many Chinese generations in preservation of this order, then he thinks it would be opening new ways of popularity for Islam and acceptance yes. for Islam. Is uh, that you? Yeah, yes. Right. And more two things. But uh, this is a very intricate subject. Yes. I don't want you to pay your attention no, yes, to it have, as I long cannot, as you I have, have not translated the Holy Quran. Yes. You know, yes. that is more important to me first. Ah, yes, yes. So you better pay all your attention and time. Yes to the translation of the Holy Quran. Yes. And if just when you are tired, you know, ah, you want way. diversion. No, after his you want diversion, yes. keep it handy and then just look at it and sort of, ah, you know, yes, this is very difficult. as a mental, yes. you know, relaxation, yes. Yes. you can pursue this occasionally. Yes. And in the meantime, you also, once you submitted it to me, didn't you? Please, please, Did uh, you submit this to me once? This, uh, have you given it to me? Uh, no. This one? Uh, yes. Yes, this is with... Uh, is it the same thing? Uh, yes. Uh, no, the symbols. Symbols. Uh, the order uh, yes. of the symbols. Oh, no, 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 I have sent to you and also I have many. I can keep... You have what it has? Yes. Right. So I want to distribute upon them. I see. You have, you have already brought quite a few copies. Yes. It yes, can, you can distribute to anyone. Uh, so this is... What I understand, this is going to be an open invitation to, for everybody. He has brought already copies to be distributed. So whoever wants to apply his mind to this and try to solve the dilemma <coughs> would be most welcome. Yeah, you European log, has a young log. Who is kitab say file nikati? Can you call them? File. Kismat nikati. File, acha acha kismat. Divining from books, you know. They try to read future through random opening of certain holy books. This is called divining. That's right, yes. See, it takes an Englishman to lead you to the right word. <laughs> but I had read it, I remembered, I had read the right word and it was just missing me, you know. Divining is the word. So he says that in Europe, many people use this, this symbolism for divining. They, in, in some difficult questions they can't solve, they can't, uh, I mean, decide themselves. They open this book at random by keeping in their mind that we'll read the third line or so. So they, they re receive the message and this is a practice, common practice now in Europe. Not a common, but this Man, is yeah. a practice now practice, in Europe. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. Who told you this? Uh, the Europeans don't seem to be aware of this. He says this book is now being sold as a popular book for divining. Yes, you know, you know that. Oh, he knows. Yes, yes, yes. Good. But why you don't know this? Why should they do it? 
where you should do it. Ne mirkhe am samjhi nahi aayi lekin ye hai ke masalan 64 mirkhe am 64 ek changes hai. Wo ek nikale isman 6 steps hai. Acha. 6 steps hai. Isman asal mein mera nazdeek wo wo khigmat hai. اس خدمت کچھ تجربہ بھی لکھا ہوا ہے کیا تجربہ یعنی کچھ چھ سٹیجز تجربہ 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 وہ اس سے وہ بتاتے ہیں کہ اس اگر آپ شادی کرنا ہو تو یہ موقع ہے یہ اگر سفر کرنا ہو یہ ٹھیک نہیں ہے اس قسم کے وہ نکالتے ہیں تو لیکن تب ہی چیز ہے اگر اس کا فیلسوفی سمجھ لیں تب ہی ترتیب سمجھ لیں مثلا مثلا میند دی ہے میند دی کے لیے میند دی کا ستیج ہے یہ خرکت ہے اس میں چھے ستیج ہے تو مثلا چھے ستیج کزنے کے بعد اس کا تب ہی دریہ ہوگا تولد مل جائے گی لیکن جب وہ مینت کی چیز چھین دیکھ لیا پتا دیا آمیر ہو جائے گا وہ خوش ہو جائے گا کہنا آمیر ہو جائے گا میرا خیال ہے according to what he understands this system is this Chinese system has first to begin with 64 steps and these 64 are in reality subheadings regarding various human activities. These subheadings are further divided into six steps. And uh, those steps are to be understood so that one can uh, carve one's path of li in life, one can uh, positively form a policy and in the light of these steps. And he indicates, for instance, uh, there is uh, mentioned application of labor. This is one uh, subheading. And that is uh, broken up into six steps with the result ultimately that if you follow these six steps, then you will be wealthy. Your, your labor would bear fruit. So people here, if they chance upon this particular number, then they say, oh, this is now we will become wealthy, you know, because we have seen it. So what he says is, it's not by seeing that you become wealthy, but by understanding that philosophy and following those steps in the same order. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Right. yes. yes. <laughs> and they misuse it. Yes, of course. They but misuse. actually these things are very important. <laughs> According to me, yes. uh, it's very important. Because yes. I, I, I had a dream when I... Uh, اردو میں بتائیں تو خواب میں نے کتاب تیار کر رہا تھا یہ امام زہو امام میں دی کچھ ریفرنس آیا تھا جنہیں لوگ پرانا انبیاء تمام انبیاء سب اوپر انگار کر دیا کہتا ہے یہ سب فضول ہے اس میں ایک نبی تھا جو اس کتاب شروع سے انہیں تیار کیا تھا تو یہ بھی کوئی آدمی ہے نہیں بسے فضول اور حالانکہ بعض تاریخ میں یہ لکھا ہے کہ اس کا نام فشی ہے کیا فشی 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 اور مسلمان کہتے ہیں علماء کہتے ہیں کہ یہ نوح کا بیدا تھا یہ عجیب ہے لیکن عام مسلمانی سمجھتے ہیں نہیں مانتے تو اس نے وہ آسمان و زمین لیلہ ما فی سماوادی غور کرتے رہے ان نے دیکھا میرا خواہن کشف ہوگا یہ بھی مسلمان کیسے ہیں میں یہ سمجھتا ہوں کشف میں دیکھا کہ سمندر سے کھورا نکل آئے سمندر سمندر سے کھورا کھورا آئے کھورا سمندر کا کھورا آیا ہے اس کی بیت پر کچھ نشانات تھی اس نشانات کی پہنا پر ان نے یہ تیار کیا تھا تو جب وہ ریفرنس میرا سمجھ آیا کیونکہ میں سبھی کرنا تھا کہ ان کتابیں تبدیلیاں ہوئی میں نے کہا یہ بھی لکھا ہے کہ یہ ایسا شیئے سے موجود ہے نہیں پھر میں نے خواب دیکھا کہ خواب دیکھا گیا کہ یہ نبی موجود تھے اس کا مطلب یہ کوئی سوس ہے کوئی اچھی بات He says that why I consider it very important 